Oscar, take a one control. Tango one. Thank you. Can you show me on a traffic stop, please, uh, Brew Gaming U? With a pedal cyclist, uh, reason stop is the uh, careless cycling over. Tango one, receive. You've got a cross street. Uh, nearest cross street is going to be um, McDonald Street over. Hello. Tango one, receive. Put your one. Hello. Okay, uh, any idea where we might stop you today? I mean, I guess it's for riding in the pavement, but uh, personally I think it's a lot safer for me to ride in the pavement due to all the snow because I'll be too big of a hazard uh, if I go on the road because I'm going to be slow and the road's a lot slippier since cars are driving, it's just saying it's slow. Listen out. Right. Oscar Charlie 3-3, three, three, Oscar me. Charlie 3-2. Three, 3-3 three, three receiving. 3-1 three, receiving. Yeah, three three and three two. You three two. Three one three two. Right. Sorry, three three and three two. Um, they're asking if you can put the road closure on the ASAP. Sound. The reason I stopped you today is actually for running a red light. Well, the more. Oh. Sorry. I was just crossing the like. Road because I was on the pavement. I know you was crossing the road. So you're running the red light, you're cycling over the pavement, and you haven't got any lights on your bike. Any reason for that? No, that's like uh, like I said, that's why I'm riding on the pavement because I mm. feel a lot safer what, here. What about the red light? And I'm going to no continue. Well, there are no lights. This bike doesn't have lights. It's a BMX. Okay. And the red light. I was on the. I was on the pavement, and there was a like a go sign for me. Mm, I don't think there was. On the on the pavement lights. No, I don't think there was. Because I I checked that as well. So, um, there's a number of issues there. Okay. Have you got any form of ID of you? On you? Mm, no, it's at the house. Do you have any form of ID on you? No, it's at the house. Okay, step on the bike for me. Many thanks. Okay, uh, we'll do. You can have a seat in the back of my car. It's quite cold. Okay, and we'll uh, do a discussion. Alright. Right. Um, is it your bike? Yep. What's your name then? Richard. Richard, okay, Richard, have you got a driving license or? Uh, no. You don't have a driving license, okay, what's your last name, Richard? Davis. D A V I E S, is that right? D A V I S. Oh, yes. Okay, what's your birth, Mr. Davis? The 2nd of the 2nd of 1991. The 2nd of the 2nd, 1991, is that correct? Yeah. That's brilliant. Uh, how old are you going to be on your next birthday? Uh, I mean, uh, too old, I guess. Oh, well, but uh, no, uh, I'm, I'm going to. How old are you going to be? Yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to be eighteen. Eighteen. Okay, yeah. mate. At the moment, I don't believe you're giving me correct details. Okay, so do we want to start again? Are you going to come come back My name. and be locked up? What's your name? Like I said, my name is Richard Davis, officer. What's your date of birth then? 2nd of the 2nd of 1991. I mean, I've had one beer to drink. I might be like a little bit intoxicated, not too much though. So you've had something to drink? But I've had one beer. Having one beer doesn't prevent you from knowing how old you'll be your next birthday. So, how old are you now? Let's start there. How old are you now? I am 27. You're 27? Really? Like 27. 27, 28. I can't really remember when my birthday was. You don't know if you're 27 or 28? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's 28. Uh, okay, well, fella, you want to start being honest with me now? Where do you live? What's your address? 
Uh, Grove Street in the cold sack. Grove Street. What number? Yeah. Yeah. Five zero five. Five zero five. Yeah. That's my new house. It's still gonna. Impressive. It's like um. Yeah, when you like run my name, uh, it's still gonna come back to my old address due to me um, like only just moving house recently. Oh really? Uh, and like I've been out of the country as well, really? like for some time, so I haven't like had time to live in my old address. But I just bought this new house. Really? What's the postcode then? Yeah. Well, I don't, I don't even. I, I mean, I don't really care about postcodes. No, I mean, I don't remember not. the postcode. So your address is uh, number five zero five Grove Street. Correct. Hello. Wait. Get it. Is that correct? Yep, it's still correct. Yep, it's correct. Okay. Uh, in the colour set. Okay. What have I still need? What, what, what have I told you? Number five zero five doesn't exist. There's not five hundred hours in Grove Street. Okay. At the moment, you're under arrest for obstruct place. You're not saying anything may harm your defence. If you don't mention a question, so it's related to in court. Anything you do say may be given evidence. Okay. It's quite easy. You can either do it the hard way. Or the easy way, okay. So I'm just gonna pop pop out, pop scuffs on you here. Pop out the vehicle for me for a minute. Lovely. I mean like I said, officer, I live on five zero five Grove Street. That's the house number. Oh, okay. I'm sure it is. Just like you're eighteen years old on your next birthday, aren't you? Of late. I mean, I want to believe I'm 18. Well, I'm sure you do. So, uh, because you've been dishonest with me, I'm not very pleasured by that. So you are going to be reported for the following of offences in addition to obstructing police. Um, you're going to be reported for careless cycling times two, cycling over the pavement and cycling through a red light, and also cycling without any lights on. Fines are going to be amounting to £150. Okay. Uh, furthermore, it's going to bring you a breathalyzer test before we go to the station. Have you had anything to drink? No, well, you told me you had, so... Yeah, yeah, just that one beer. Lovely. So I'm just gonna give you a breath. I mean, I'm being honest with you. Oh, I'm, I'm being honest I, I, with you. I, 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 can, just, I can tell. I, I can tell. So, see you later around the tube. I just have a weak head. I, I would be very yeah. surprised if this came back under the limit. Keep blowing, 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 keep blowing. Right. So you've also blown over the. Uh, Drink drive limit, meaning that in fact you're not as sober as just one beer, much you like to hope so. Okay, so if you're under arrest on suspicion yeah. of driving whilst I'll fit through drink, or cycling whilst I'll fit through drink, shall I say? Same caution applies. Alright. So I'm gonna lock your bike uh, up for okay, you, put it, I mean... put it on the side of the road here, okay? Okay. Let's take one control. Sound resumed. Oscar Tango Walker Trump. Oscar Thank you. Um, I've got one locked up for uh, obstruct police uh, and cycling whilst unfit through drink. Am I able to get a van towards my location, please, or another transport unit? It's going to be Brugam, are you ever? If you tell me your real name, like we, can said, deal, we can deal with it properly, but... One, one, one. Yeah, no, like I said, my name is one, one. Uh, Richard Davis. Mm. One, one. I mean, uh... Are you free uh, to assist Oscar Tango? I, I was the one who called yeah, one, you guys for the green pal as well, but I was just going out for a ride now since I was like told to leave. Can I be towards Broke Avenue, cross with McDonald Street, please, for the transport? I mean, I've, I've had, like, a bit to drink, obviously, yeah, that's but, uh... I'll slang my control. Yeah, if there's no van, uh, I'll simply self-transport. There's no point just putting him in a different traffic car. Um, I'll take him around to the station now. Uh. Yeah, 